Hey everybody, here's another water comparison video. Tonight I'm comparing these two waters. These are both black waters. First up is black water. Next up is a black water called Fulham by Earthwater. And no, these are not labels on the bottles. This is actually the color of the water. Um, two years ago, in January 2016, I reviewed black water. And, you know, I did a taste test. And I could barely tell the difference between this and standard tap water. And I'm reviewing it again because I didn't include it in my comparison chart video series. Full hum water was $15 for a four pack on Amazon. So that's $3.75 per bottle. The BLK water I got from Giant Eagle this time and it was $1.99. In 2016, the only place I could find this water was on Amazon, and I paid $8 the first time I bought the black water, so I'm glad it's uh, gone down in price. The nutritional information on both of these bottles is almost identical. They both have zero for everything, zero fat, sugar, carbs, all that stuff. The only difference is BLK water has zero sodium, and the Earth water has zero 0 0.07 milligrams of sodium which is basically nothing but um, that's what it has so the reason it, that these are black is because of like fulvic acid and uh, natural minerals and they both have a lot of claims on the bottle and on their websites about um, health benefits the full home water even comes with this pamphlet I'm not going to read the whole thing to you I'll just Put it on the screen you can read it yourself if you want to see all of it but some of their claims include improvements to, to your gut health and to your immune function and they say it helps boost your digestion and they say it lowers your free radicals and it repairs your skin health the full home water is from a municipal water source in dallas texas they just start with standard tap water basically for this one and then they just inject the extra minerals and fulvic acid into it full home water on their website they even sell a version of this without the water they sell a packet and a little like lid injection thing with just the fulvic acid and the minerals which is kind of smart it saves on shipping costs for the weight of the water and uh so you just Use your own tap water and just inject it in, into that. Um, so let's open these up and do a taste test comparison. I like both of these waters. I mean, the, like the, the bottles themselves. This one is like very modern and sleek. And, you know, it's very high contrast. And there's words hidden in the label that you don't see until you drink the water. And it's, it's you know, cool. It's, you know, really good looking. It's like a mini smart water bottle it's um and this one has a very unique bottle you know it has the earth on top and it has black below it so it kind of looks like float like earth is floating in space um it's very unique and obviously they designed this bottle just for this water they're not like reusing some other bottle design a problem is <laughs> there's a flaw in the design because they all have a dent in the bottle and I bought four of these they all have a dent and I was watching another guy on YouTube reviewing this water his has his had a dent too if it was one I would just assume it was just damaged during shipment but if it's all four of them you know in the same spot it's some kind of design flaw in the in the bottle itself maybe it was bottled at a you know different air pressure or something like that so here we go. Let's open them up and uh, do a taste test. No smell. Yeah, no smell. I mean, like I said, the first time I had these, I couldn't... I could barely tell the difference between this and regular water. Maybe like a slight like a slight sweet taste to it and for this one
Yeah, it's... They're both very similar. I bet they both taste like waters. Um, the BLK water claims to have a 8.0 pH level. The earth water does not claim to have a pH level at all. You know, normally I start off my videos, my water reviews, by dropping these drops into the water to uh, test the pH level. But obviously I can't do that for these because you wouldn't see what color it turns into. Because I think the, the black would just wash out the, the color of the test drops. See, I was talking about the hidden message. You can see the black text now because you uh, couldn't see it with the contrast before. But now you can uh, see it. Yeah, maybe like a like a super 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 mild flavor of tea, like. Take a normal tea bag and make it 90% smaller and then drop the tea bag into a cup of water for one minute and you would have this super mild taste of tea. But the, the taste is very similar. It's like, like neither, neither of them has a strong difference between the two. Um, the taste is actually so close that I'm going to say it's a tie as far as the taste goes, but I'm going to say that BLK water is the winner because of, you know, other factors. BLK water has less sodium. It has a lower price from Giant Eagle and the bottle is not dented. And, um, yeah. So since that's a tie for the taste, I'm going to say BOK Water is the winner. I'm moving on to the next round because of those other factors. So, you know, thanks for watching, everybody. Um, happy Black History Month. And uh, take care.